Welcome to today's Technical Corner. I'm going to be joined by Dominic Prinsloo today from Open Minds UK, and we're going to be talking about turning. Everybody knows that um, Open Mind are the, uh, the go-to product uh, with their Hypermill software for, for milling. Um, but today we're going to be talking about turning. Can you maybe give us a very quick overview of the, uh, the turning products that you offer or products for turning? Yes, um, Paul, like you were saying, is that uh, most of people know us for the milling product, but uh, a lot of people don't know actually how powerful our turning package is as well. Um, you have your general tool parts that you will have in any other CAM package. Um, we also have a big boost in our tutorial side of things in it and how the product has developed over the last two years. Now, when it comes when it comes to turning, um, I, I suppose on, on the milling side, a lot of people think of of hyper mill for you know five axis machining. When we do a lot of uh, work with you guys, illustrating that actually even simple parts can benefit uh, from your software. Is that the same with turning, or do you have to have you know multi axis, multi function machines, or are you covering industry across the board on uh, turning and lathes? We cover all, all uh, parts you could cut, uh, from simple parts to more complex parts. So even your standard two-axe machine would benefit from from us uh, with the normal X, Y, uh, X, Z machining that you get. And so um, you would get your complex parts that will be machined on your more complex mill uh, uh, turns with your B rotation in it. But in general, it's covering all sectors. Okay, and what, what's the benefit? What's the benefit to using it, Dominic? I mean, is it down to you know reducing uh, cycle times, improving that productivity? Is it ease of use? Tell us some of the the benefits. Yes, Paul, it's actually very easy to use the package. To be fair, um, if you uh, if you've been using the software on the milling side, if you convert over to become a turner, if that's a term you would like to use, it's pretty easy. Uh, the interface is exactly the same as the milling, so. It's no different environment that you have to go into. And it's actually very simple to use the toolpath because it's using a feature and just snap on start and endpoints and there you go. You do two acts, three acts, not multiple machining. And one of the intentions, obviously, from an engineering perspective is to is to reduce tool wear, uh, obviously improve tool life, um, but make components far quicker. Is that what your software can offer engineers? Yes, Paul. Uh, we do um, rate ourselves highly for cut, cutting cycle time for customers and try and improve at all, at all times. Uh, you do get it with your turning as well. We have got some samples that we were using where the standard face turning, external turning, you know, like a G71, G72 in the funny environment. And then we've compared it with our Hypermax turning, which have reduced cycle times dramatically. Okay, and, and, and just also really to, to try and explore uh, where it does fit and where it doesn't fit. Who, who's the perfect user? Uh, for your, you know, for your turning modules, are there companies out there that really wouldn't benefit from this if they had a lathe, and ones that that do specifically, or does it really cover any machine shop where they are doing turning operations? Well, I would say all companies would benefit from it. To be fair, uh, the fact is that you can program away from the machine while the machine is running. And you know that when you do your internal machine simulation beforehand, that if you do get collision, it will be genuine collision. So you know that the code that you provide to the shop floor would be correct first time. So I can see that why people wouldn't want to invest in the turning package with the accuracy in collision checking and turning. And we're going to hear from one of your customers in a minute uh, that I visited uh, a short time ago. But before, before we leave uh, yourself, Dominic, what about the training and the support that goes alongside this? Because investing in software is one thing, but being able to learn how to use it effectively is as important, if not more important. Yeah, we have of late updated all our training content, Paul, where we show the simple turning stuff on the on the two-day training course where uh, it's just your normal X and Z machining. And then we, up, we move it all the way up to your more complex, which is our three acts simultaneous machining as well on the, on the uh, final day of uh, training. And what we also do, we send our customers 
loads of uh, video clip samples uh, along to take with them after training course so that when they go into their own environment, they do have that to fall back on. Uh, we support them 24-7 when, whenever they need, need to help from our end. Okay, now it's been uh, fantastic that you could join us today, Dominic. We've got a lot more technical corners coming up that are going to focus specifically on areas of the software uh, and they'll be coming in due course. But as for now, uh, what I wanted to do is to cut to one of the interviews we did with one of your customers, at Doosan Precision, a user of your uh, turning modules. Let's hear from David Booth. Okay, so we were spending um, a long time setting up quite difficult parts. Um, quite intricate setups, um, difficult features to machine. That was the reason why. And, and, and were you then facing, um, you know, pricing issues with your customers, Absolutely, unable yeah. to meet their their yeah. requirements? Yeah, we lost some work um, overseas, which we managed to win back with after purchasing the software. So, what has the software actually done then? In order, you know, it might sound obvious, but by the sounds of it, just reduce the manufacturing time on the parts? Well, it reduces the setup time massively. You know, from four or five hours, some parts are taken to program and set. You can be down to half an hour. What's interesting for me as well is hypermill, open mind. A lot of people associate that with just milling, but yeah. of course, what we're talking about here is turning. They're yeah. turning modules. Absolutely. That, that was the attraction for you, because that's mainly what you're doing. That's why we bought it. We bought it with the turning in mind. That's what we bought it for.